Hi, I'm uh, Bianca Ambram. Uh, I'm a proud uh, Yidinji Goring Goring woman. Uh, I've been working here at HealthShare Parramatta um, for probably seven years now. Started working in the production with all the women, uh, you know, processing linen through the machines, and I mentioned that I had a HR license. So my supervisor is like, oh, you want to train in the trucks and we can take you out to the hospitals. Growing up in far north Queensland, I grew up with, uh, you know, a lot of my boy cousins. We was always in the backyard kicking footies around. Um, also, like, work-wise, I've always worked on fruit farms, uh, done ranger work, working on country back home, uh, you know, and working around mining sites too, uh, driving a lot of different machinery. Uh, you know, I was always my dad's girl, um, always going with him to work because uh, he was a truck driver, my old man. So he would always teach me on the roads and that. I've always had confidence uh, working around men because uh, that's been my past jobs and I've always been physical hands-on work. I'm not uh, a woman to sit in the office, uh, I just think I can't stand that, I get too bored. So yeah, I like uh, working in the outdoors. Uh, when I turned 18, I represented Queensland and Australia for uh, Rugby League, uh, also Indigenous women's side. That's something that uh, I've been keeping quiet from Hellshire Parramatta. <laughs> that they don't know. <laughs> That's why um, I can hang around uh, fellas, you know. Uh, us women are more patient, uh, especially with trucks and, uh, you know, doing men's job, we can do it too, so, you know. I feel a part of their world and, you know, we're together, yeah. Uh, they're like my family. They're amazing, so supportive. Um, Lana and all her crew. You know, I'm happy to go to the workshops every year with them and, uh, you know, do all the courses and that because, uh, you know, you get excited when you see your own mob, so, yeah. <laughs> with me, uh, you know, I just come to work, learn different things every day, learn things, get qualifications, and I just keep going, like, you know, like I said, I, I don't like working in the office, but you never know. I've done a management course, you never know where the wind might take me. But yeah, I'm proud of being Indigenous. I'm um, always proud of my culture. Uh, I'm big on my culture and, uh, you know, I just want to inspire uh, young Indigenous kids out there. It doesn't matter if you want to be in health or wherever, uh, give it a go. Uh, whatever you want to become, uh, you know, learn things diff every day, different, different things, take it in. Uh, you know, it might drive you to your dream job or what you want to become. Mm -hmm. I love my job driving as a truck driver here and, okay. and I like to see those people at the hospital with smiles on their face when they see the deliveries coming, so yeah.